date the rate, marry the house. <laughs> <laughs> well, I love it because we can get a better date too. <laughs> right, right. Gina and I have been talking about our buyers these days. What I'm seeing anyway are uh, they seem to be much more worried, much more anxiety about the rising interest rates. You and I have been through this before. You know, right. we've seen it all before. Yep. It doesn't scare us. So we know that uh, we can get our clients a lower interest rate just mm -hmm. through our negotiations. Why don't we run through the hypothetical situation that you and I talked about? We have clients that are looking at homes that are in the 450 range. Mm -hmm. um, we found one that's 450 that they love. So can you run through those scenarios? Sure, sure. So with these scenarios, we're going to do, you know, the rates are just estimates with how much rates are fluctuating right now. You just, you really want to be in tune with that and check with your lender and have them run rates for you before you make an offer. The first scenario is without paying any points. So you wouldn't be buying down rate at all. And so on a 450,000 purchase with 5% down payment, that would make the mortgage around 427. The interest rate without buying it down would be 5.875. Okay. Approximately. Now again, interest rates go up and down on a daily basis right now. Of it's, course. So that payment would be around twenty five twenty nine, just principal and interest. So we're not including taxes or insurance. Since the market's more cooling now, you know that yes. uh, sellers are much more willing to negotiate with us. Right. So let's just say you negotiate that the price is actually fifteen thousand less. That's a good one. Yep. Um, and four thirty-five purchase price, and then with five percent down, your loan amount's going to be four thirteen two fifty. Nice. And assuming that same exact rate as the first scenario at five point eight seven five. Your payment then, principal and interest, is going to be $2,445. I mean, there are there is some savings, but it's not significant. It's only about $84 a month. Yeah. And so, you, you know, if, yeah, says, if that's all you knew, that, that would sound great, yeah, right? Right. But you right. and I know there's a different way to do it to lower right. the interest rate. Yeah. yeah. So and like you like. said, with the market kind of shifting, sellers are a little bit more eager to get their houses sold and yeah. help the buyers out. So if um, the seller was willing to do a credit towards the buyer's closing costs, then you can then apply that towards a buy down of the rate. Right. So let's assume we're back to the original price of 450. Okay. Um 5% down with your loan amount of the 427500. Okay. But let's say the seller is willing to give you about $10,000. Even better. Um, yeah. Right. Towards your closing costs, you could possibly buy down the rate to 4.75. Okay. Wow. And then that would make your payment 2230. So 2230 a month, which is a savings of approximately $299 a month. Whoa, $300 a month. Right. So it's better. It's actually a benefit for the buyer to go at full price, but ask for the seller to pay yeah, totally towards their agree. closing costs. Years ago, but it hasn't been a thing for a long time. So I think a lot of people had forgotten that this is something you can do. So right. And like everybody's saying, the prices are not going down, right? They're mm -hmm. they're continuing to steadily increase. And if you get that buy down, then yeah. you're locked in. And as you know, Tara, we've been doing this, like you said, a long time. Interest rates go up and down. Yeah. And who knows, down the road, we may have another dip in rates. And you can always refinance yes. at that time too. Exactly. But I think the benefit right now is that buyers really need, if they're serious about buying, they need to get in while the market is where it is right now, because it is going to, housing prices are going to go up. They're still estimating that we're going to have probably a 4% appreciation this yeah, year. Year over year. Yep. Yeah. We don't know what's going to happen tomorrow. So take advantage right. of the sellers being more willing to work with people. So exactly. Yeah. Thank you.